Colorectal cancer affects men and women of all backgrounds. 60% of this kind of cancer can be avoided by getting screened. Ashley Morin spoke with the Needham Public Health Nurse Donna Carmichael to learn more. March is colorectal screening month um, and it's very important for anyone age 50 and over to get screened for colorectal cancer. Colorectal cancer is one of those cancers that can be prevented if caught early. It's very important for all of us to talk with our doctors about getting screened for colorectal cancer. Symptoms of colorectal cancer include a change in bowel habits and blood in the stool. Colorectal cancer usually starts with polyps that develop in the, in the colon. And if we can catch those polyps early and remove them, those polyps usually turn into cancer. So we try to get those out early so that they don't turn into cancer as we age. And how that's usually done, usually, is through a colonoscopy. Um, and where um, uh, it's a procedure that's done um, and those polyps are removed. And the biggest concern people usually have and people usually have concern about is the prep ahead of time. So the preps have come a long way. Um, years and years ago, the preps were very, very difficult. And I'm not saying they're pleasant, but it's, um, they're, they're a lot milder than they used to be. And it isn't very important for the colon to be cleared out completely so the colon is visualized to see those small polyps that are growing. So that's why it's important, that's why the, the, one of the most important tests for colorectal screening is um, a colonoscopy. The people that are at highest risk for developing col colorectal cancer are those with a family history. So if you have um, family history of anyone else in your family having colorectal cancer, um, those who have inflammatory bowel disease or have had um, inflammation of their bowel in any other way on a regular basis, um, definitely speak with your doctor about having screening done earlier rather than later. Um, and um, those that, um, you know, just don't have a great lifestyle. So it's just somebody that everyone after 50 years old should be screened.